Well, good morning to one and all. So the format of these this weekend is basically it's going to be like a relay race. One of us is going to run a section uh, with you guys, and then we're going to have a break, and then the other of us will come on. Some of the things that you'll notice will be in common in how we work, and there will be some differences. There may be strong arguments as well. I'm not sure. We've got a very similar view on a lot of uh, areas, but there will be differences as well, and I think that personally is a good thing. Is that right? That sounds about right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saving it all for later. One of the reasons I wanted to do this workshop was that what I discovered in, I was fresh from varying training courses, hypnotherapy, NLP. I trained as a counselor as well. One of the things I noticed that what happens and what really works well in a training setting didn't always work so well in client settings. And that I noticed that clients didn't respond and behave in quite the same ways that people on the workshops did. They'd ask awkward questions, behave in awkward ways, and, and do things that the workshop trainees didn't do because they weren't trained as workshop trainees. They were trained as themselves. So an awful lot of what I'm going to be covering are what are the patterns, what are the trends that clients present in client settings, and what are the patterns and models that I work with in interacting with those patterns. Yeah, and a lot of things uh, I'm going to be uh, demonstrating and talking about throughout the weekend are approaches that I find that work really, really well with certain kinds of conditions. Uh, also, other elements of how to check and set up and watch for client expectations. And we'll talk about some of the kinds of communications you get from people and requests, which there are certain emails where you read something and you go, what? I don't even understand what that means. Um, so there's a whole bunch of different things, as Andy says, which are completely outside what I would have heard of or been taught on specific trainings. But I thought a good way to start the day is, because some of you guys know each other and some of you guys don't, but in this kind of workshop, to make it really pertinent for you guys so that you get what's relevant for you, I thought we'll start off by just a three-minute exercise where find whoever's closest to you uh, at the moment and find out from the other person what would be most useful for them to get from this weekend you know, in one simple statement without writing it down. Just communicate from A to B, so for example, Michael to Mark. Okay, what is it that would be most useful for you to get from this weekend so that we get an idea of what you guys would be most interested in? and then we can factor in some of what we do towards that. Is everybody clear? This is yes? <laughs> cool, okay, so let's, let's do that, and then let's get some, some feedback. 